Potholes continue to be the talk of the town for local drivers. Earlier this week, we checked in with the city of Spokane, and they told us they filled about 200 potholes so far this season. As our Nikki Torres learned today, it's not just city crews hard at work. Nikki, there are crews all throughout the region dealing with the same issue. Yes, the pothole patrol teams are everywhere, not just on our local roads, but also on our highways and on the on and off ramps as well. And it's actually not just the paved roads. Spokane County is dealing with some gravel roads right now as well. And what it all comes down to really is weather. Today it's been okay. It's been relatively dry for the most part. But what happens is when they put in that cold mix, some rainfall will come in and wash it out. And then it's just a cycle that keeps going on and on and on. Potholes here, potholes there. It seems as if Spokane drivers are noticing potholes everywhere. See a hole, fill it up. See a hole, fill it up. That's what's happening all around the region. Washington State Department of Transportation is filling potholes on our local highways. Spokane Valley's winter crew is out maintaining streets. They've patched around 100 potholes this winter so far. And Spokane County working on both paved and gravel roads. In all, hundreds of potholes have been reported and filled throughout our area. And Mother Nature is mostly to blame. Freeze thaw, that's kind of the, the biggest problem, especially when we get melting snow, it gets into the roadway, you get underneath, it freezes again overnight, and the expansion of the ice and it freezing in the roadway is what gives us potholes. Since November, WSDOT has filled more than 100 potholes. We roughly each winter use about 30,000 tons of cold mix to fill potholes a year. Cold mix is what all crews are using this time of year as opposed to the hot mix during the summer to fill potholes. And the reason for it... Hot mix asphalt is 300 plus degrees when they lay it. Hot mix doesn't pair well when the roads are wet and temperatures fluctuate. Higher volumes, roads first, and then we work our way down. And the crews filling the potholes are the same faces you see snow plowing. When there's no snow on the ground, they're driving around looking for spots to repair on the streets. Snow and ice control is our number one priority in the winter, um, but we're used to this. As soon as we come out of that, then we put people in the trucks to do the, the pothole patching. If you're in North Idaho and you need to report a pothole in Coeur d'Alene, you can send them an email with exactly where it is. And for Kootenai County, they do have an online form you can fill out to report a pothole. And both of those web addresses are listed on your screen right now. We will also have both of those posted on KXLY.com. Now, we keep talking about cold mix versus that hot mix. So when can we start using that hot mix that'll stick around a little bit more permanently? Spokane County told me that the hot mix asphalt plants will actually open right around early April, depending on weather. Reporting in Spokane tonight, I'm Nikki Torres for News Now.